morning world welcome to tuesday 22nd december the shortest day is gone although today is as short as yesterday so shortest day is almost gone right all of my cattle need a bale i need three bales in there one in there and i was actually thinking I know one or two comments have come back as a fours about this uh, bag off, bail off challenge. Um, we could actually do it because I have got one, two, three bales that I, I either got a patch, but I think I think they're past their going past their best. They need using, um, and even though I don't really want to mess about with the cattle's diet, with. Uh, changing from hay to haylage and back to hay um, these these won't do it that should not be soft so that bit's spoilt that bit's spoilt this isn't so bad because I think there was a bag next to it um, so I will see I mean, maybe maybe over the next day or so we will see if we can get these three bales out and maybe no one's directly challenged me I've had messages saying, come on Ian, get your finger out, you should do it. But no one's directly challenged me yet, so. Right, okay, so, bit of news. The water drinker that we fitted yesterday is, da -da, still on the wall. They haven't broken it off yet, but there is a plan B. I mean, that is in there with expanding um, wall uh, lock bolts in there, but if, if they do loosen it, then I think what we'll do, we'll just end up, we'll just drill right through the hole. I'll put some coach bolts in there and I will literally bolt the thing right through with great big washers on the back. We'll have to grind anything off flat unless we put the coach bolts through from the other way, because obviously cattle and stock could go up and down through the little gate there as a race. Look, you haven't really finished that off, so you're not really starving, are you? Oh, oh, you want that. Okay. Um, a little bit of bad news perhaps for some of our foreign followers that have ordered mugs and calendars and stuff like that. Uh, we've had a notification this morning that the British Post Office have ceased all international post. So even if I get the calendars today, I can't actually send them to you. So this is obviously to do with COVID and stuff like that. So, um, we wouldn't be able to send anything to get it to you for Christmas anyway if you wanted it for a Christmas holiday. Some of you may want it for a different holiday or just for a gift. But um, at the moment, we can't send anything, as far as I'm aware, internationally outside the UK um, until the post office lift that um, restriction. So apologies for that. Not much I can do about it. Yeah, all right, it's coming. Yeah, so sorry about that for anybody who was hoping to get um, calendars and mugs and stuff before New Year. Um, I don't think it's going to happen. Yeah. Right, so that's them. They've got their bit of grub to go on with. We need to give the cows some bales. Uh, Julie's actually in the house packing up mugs and t-shirts and caps and stuff now. Um, we've, we're getting quite thin on the old stock now. That was the whole idea this year. We were going to run down what stock we had before we went into any more real clothing and spending money on stock um, this year. So we just run down what we had. Uh, we're, we're getting there now. Um, there will be, uh, for those who want it, uh, we've tentatively ordered 100 beanies um, from the guys who make these. And we've also tentatively ordered a load more of these with the new logo on. But the new logo will, on these, will include an extra animal. Some of you know. All right. Okay. 
let's get to it. Isn't it nice? It's actually not raining. Uh, anyway, those of you who watched yesterday's slightly naughty video, and I will apologise if somebody did, anybody did get offended by any of the remarks on there, but kind of, uh, it's just me, you know, I'm an offensive person, apparently, occasionally. So, but it will also explain to um, those of you who are asking why I limp. Um, some days I limp more than other days, but it is basically because my left leg is a quarter inch longer than my right leg because I had steel pins and stuff put in there. Um, I might actually get my pin out sometime and show it you because I've still got it. Uh, it's called a K nail, Krishna nail I think it is. It's a big long piece of steel that goes down the middle of me bone. So, and I do still have it. So, right, okay, cattle. The yards are swimming. Come on, out! You gotta look that way, don't look at me. Look out! Out! Get out! Come on! Out! I just gotta look at you, just in case you might do something interesting. Go on, get out! Out! Go on! Out! Go on! I had a lot of inquiries in the last week for beef packs. Our first. Go on! Our first animal for 2021 is actually already sold. In fact, we're almost halfway through the second one as well. Go on out. Go on. And you. Go on. Um, so those of you who are looking at ordering beef packs, regulars, whatever else, um, yes, the order book is open, but you have got to remember that um, we can't put an animal in to slaughter until well, March, because the avatar is booked up till then. Um, and then it has to hang for 30 days. So you're looking at April before you get it. So just as long as you know that. Um, but yes, we are we are now taking orders for next year. And it'll be first up, best dressed. Okay, all you tune haters, prepare to hit the mute button. So why the ladder, you say? Well, the ladder is there because of that gap. There was bars, you can see the fixings there, going across here to that post. But um, I put the bars up and the cattle break them off again.
Gott! That's it. Neither. Tidy. Um, and for those of you who didn't know, no, that's not what I paid for it. That's the price for people who don't haggle. Okay, right. Ooh, two minutes to ten. Coffee time.